My brothers and sisters, Yali Madat, I hope all continues to be well with you. I want to share with you some important information regarding COVID-19 related developments and the status of Jamaat Khana reopenings around the country. As we know, the government has approved some vaccines for prevention of COVID-19 and healthcare officials around the country have started administering them. We are so pleased that many Jamaati members, particularly our elders and those with health conditions and our healthcare workers have been able to get vaccinated already. And many others are either registered or are waiting for their turn. The Jamaati institutions led by our Aga Khan Health Board for USA have been actively tracking these vaccine related developments. The government regulatory bodies that approve the vaccines have ensured that they are safe for use. To date, millions of Americans have taken the vaccine to minimize their chances of getting impacted by COVID-19. I strongly urge everyone in the Jamaat who qualifies to receive the vaccine to please get vaccinated to protect yourselves, your families, our Jamaat, and those around us from COVID-19. In almost all states, healthcare workers or elder populations or those with underlying health conditions already qualify to get the vaccine. Getting vaccinated can significantly reduce the risk of negative outcomes even if one gets COVID-19. So please do not hesitate to get vaccinated as and when you are eligible to receive the vaccine. If you need more information about the vaccine or how to get it, please reach out to the Access Help Desk at 1-844-552-2237. Or go to the to the smiley forward slash USA COVID-19 page for more information. While it is important that we all get vaccinated, it is also just as important that we do not let our guard down in taking all precautions that we have been taking for months now to prevent getting or spreading the virus. Even after getting vaccinated, while we hope we do not get COVID at all. It is possible to still get COVID with lesser negative outcomes, and it is still possible to spread the virus. So even after we get vaccinated, it is important to continue to practice physical distancing, wear face coverings, exercise good hand hygiene, and not engage in unnecessary outings or gatherings outside of our immediate households, except for work and necessary outings. I also want to take this opportunity to update you on Jamaat Khana reopenings. The Jamaati institutions have been actively monitoring conditions around the country to assess when and if it is safe to reopen specific Jamaat Khanas. As the Jamaat is aware, we had started reopening some Jamaat Khanas. We even had to reclose some Jamaat Khanas to comply with public health rules. But we are now in a position to again to reopen some Jamaat Khanas. The safety of the Jamaat in re reopening Jamaat Khanas is our primary concern. And so we are cautiously starting to reopen Jamaat Khanas again this week and beyond with smaller attendance numbers, physical distancing, requirements around face coverings and other safety measures. Mubarakis to the entire Jamaat on this renewed phase of reopenings. In order for us to successfully reopen Jamaat Khanas and keep them open, it is important that we all exercise discipline in our daily lives around COVID-19 precautions and follow all safety protocols required by Jamaati volunteers when attending Jamaat Khana. In the last couple of months, we did unfortunately see a significant increase in COVID-19 infections and hospitalizations of Jamaati members. Many of these could be traced back to social gatherings of Jamaati families with others. So please let us still not indulge in avoidable social gatherings. This pandemic is not behind us. 
and the reopening of Jamaat Khanas or getting vaccinated should not be interpreted by any of us that we can stop taking precautions. Yes, we are all tired of the pandemic, but this country has lost over a, almost a half a million citizens and this pandemic is not over. So please, let's remain very careful. For the latest information on Jamaat Khanna reopenings, please visit the.ismaili forward slash USA forward slash reopening. And for those of us whose Jamaat Khanas are reopening, please ensure that you attend the scheduled orientation sessions to better understand and prepare for attending Jamaat Khanna in a way that will feel different than when you attended Jamaat Khanna before the pandemic. On this happy occasion, I want to extend my heartiest Mubarakis to all of you. For those of us around the country whose Jamaat Khanas remain closed, I want you to know that we continue to monitor the situation actively and hope to reopen them when the government restrictions are lifted and or when it is safe to reopen. Finally, I want to take this opportunity to thank the Jamaat and the thousands of volunteers around the country who continue to help and support the Jamaat as we collectively navigate this pandemic and its impact. Inshallah, through the grace and blessing of the Imam, in due time, we will come out of this collectively and individually stronger than ever before. Thank you, and Ya Ali Madat.